very mighty snow. Sun shines down and it. it's a very spooky rattle report. <laughs> On today's show, we have some bone chilling news, but first, here's a pleasure of a moment of silence. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, and the visible, for liberty and justice for all. Varsity Boys Basketball is looking for managers. We are in need of four hardworking individuals who want to be a part of our program. Team gear, travel, and the opportunity to be a part of something big are up for grabs for those willing to take the part. If this sounds like something you are interested in, please see Coach Hassan in the gym anytime. Hello, Rattlers. St. Thomas Club will meet on the following days. November 3rd from 8.30 to 9 o'clock in the ISS room, which is in Building 1. December 7th from 8.30 to 9 o'clock in the ISS room. December 16th from 8 o'clock to 9.30 in the bus loop. From our community service project, attention members, please point ahead and contact Autumn Kennard or Miss Avery with your questions. Yearbooks are now on sale. Purchase your yearbook and or senior ad today. Go to the Instagram at Bellevue High Yearbook for more details. Ooh, the spooky and scary day is itching away toward us. And so is the urge to binge watch spooky movies. Be warned. As October ends, Halloween is just beginning. There are many ways to celebrate this horror-filled holiday, but the favorite way to get in the spooky spirit is binging Halloween films. The movies watched on the 31st appeal to a wide range of audience because of the different genres incorporated. These include some of the most popular horror movies, Scream and Halloween. The movie Scream follows Sydney as she tries to survive a murderer hunting after her and her friends. You can find this movie on Sling TV. In the movie Halloween, a killer reigns horror on a small town on Halloween night. This is available on Amazon Prime. On the more lighthearted side of this holiday are Hocus Pocus, Halloween Town, and The Nightmare Before Christmas. Hocus Pocus is one witchy movie. As the Sanderson sisters come back from the dead, it becomes Max's duty to stop them from harming the town. This movie is found on Disney+. Plus. Halloween Town revolves around a magical family who have to battle the evil mayor of their grandma's town. This movie is found on Hulu. Lastly, a Halloween favorite is The Nightmare Before Christmas. Wait... The Nightmare Before Christmas is a Christmas movie. It's in the title. You wrote the script wrong. No, no, no. It's a Halloween movie because they steal Christmas. The Grinch stole Christmas. Go watch it on Disney+. Plus. While we settle this argument, check out some of our Bellevue Rattler's favorite Halloween movies. <laughs> My favorite Halloween movie would have to be Edward Scissorhands. My favorite part from Edward Scissorhands would be where he went into the girl's bedroom and had to sleep in there and her bed was a water bed and he popped it. It was funny. Fifth grade and my favorite movie is Hocus Pocus. Um, my favorite part in the movie is when the witches are running away from the students because it's really funny and I love to watch it with my dad because he's really funny. This is Harper from the Rattler Report signing off. Stay safe Bellevue and have a happy Halloween. And the night before Christmas is a Halloween movie. No it. Hey, hey, have you ever wondered how people celebrate Halloween? Let's find out. Good morning, Rattlers. I am here to tell you what your fellow classmates think about Halloween. Many people have different views on Halloween. 35% of Americans plan not to celebrate Halloween this year. However, many students here at Bellevue are celebrating. If you're not sure how to have fun this year with your friends and family, you could take some notes from your fellow classmates along what they do. Yes, I do celebrate Halloween. And what I do on Halloween, I just spend time with my family, sometimes go trick-or-treating, 
or we just go to eat out. With I typically go to parties on Halloween, like Halloween parties. I do indeed celebrate Halloween. Um, I think it's a great time just to like let creativity flow and just let like everything. It's just like a time where you can be someone else and just have the joy of like being that person for a day. I usually dress up and go trick or treating. Um, last year, my family had a party and I took my cousins trick or treating. I think Halloween is one of the most fun holidays we have. I think it's a great excuse to dress up. It involves candy. That's awesome. Like, everybody finds something to dress up as. I think it's fun for the whole family. Fun for everyone. And this is Amy Henry Quiz signing off. Timberland Farms had their annual fall festival. This past week, here's a quick recap of all the spooky fun. Timberland Farms is one of our town's many treasures. Many of us grew up going to events at this farm. Currently, one of the events going on is the Pumpkin Patch and Fall Festival. The Fall Festival runs every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday from October 1st to October 31st. On Friday, it is open from 4 to 8 p.m. On Saturday, it is open from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. And on Sunday, it is open from 12 p.m. to 7 p.m. All admissions close at sunset, but customers may stay until previously set closed. Activities include pony rides, the Pumpkin Patch, and much more. Active military, firefighters, law enforcement, and children three and under are free. Children tickets are $6 and adult tickets are $8. Let's see what the farm owner has to say about the fall festival. You know, I like children, I like to see them have fun. I thought, to be honest with you, this would be fun. And 12 years later, they're still having fun. Really, I hope the parents enjoy it, you know. We get a lot of thank yous from the parents. But they give the children something to do. This is Zoe with the Rattler Report. Find us at YouTube, BHS Rattler Media, to hear about the school events and find additional fun content. That's all we have for announcements today. Have a spooky day, Bellevue.